So, if I remember correctly, all I need to do now is add 10 tablespoons of sugar. Oh wait, was it 10 tablespoons or 10 grams? <sighs> Isn't a tablespoon equal to a gram? I don't know. I'll just go with my first thought since that's probably more accurate. Mm, that should be ten tablespoons worth. It'll... Oh, uh, did, did I just... Put salt in here? I mean, salt and sugar both start with S, so they should be close enough, right? Mm. Mishka, is that you? Why are you three footsteps away from the main door? What do you mean you're not trying to leave? And you're doing so without telling me, no less. Is there someone you're trying to meet? It's just for an errand, you say? Hmm, how suspicious. If I recall... We weren't supposed to be doing our road tax till next week, so this doesn't add up. Other errand? What then? You can't even answer that question, and yet here you are, wearing that pretty dress, trying to leave the house. Me? Possessive? Never. You're just being suspicious. I don't want to argue with you. And in order to avoid argument, you ought to just stay home with me. Don't go out. Don't go do whatever it is you need to do. The world can wait, but I can't. After all, we don't get much time together. Hmm? We're together all the time these days? All the time isn't enough time. <sighs> Shut up! Don't make me take the doors and windows off and replace them with Walls. I will if I have to. And right now, I am awfully close to doing so. In any case, I haven't even finished interrogating you. Don't think you can try to get away from my questions just because I'm being a little nice right now. You know what? I don't feel like being so nice anymore. Tell me right where you're standing. What exactly were you going to do outside, hmm? Silence. Don't make me ask again. Or else I'll have to chain you to the kitchen table, my little mouse. I'll keep you there until you answer my questions. Hmm. You were planning to get me something? For what? There's no special occasion coming up, as far as I can remember. And I keep everything in my calendar now, after forgetting our last five anniversaries. 
special Sumi-E ink. That's rather odd. Isn't that a better gift for Albedo? That guy you dumped for me? Are you still into him? Do you still want him so much that you think of him when trying to get me gifts? Do I have to destroy him? No. Ink for my... Uh, calligraphy? How do you know I've been taking calligraphy classes? You saw me signing up online? Well, I actually took them because I wanted to do something special for your birthday. Like, I wanted to do some traditional Sumi-e paintings to remind you of Inazuma. Since... We've become fugitives there, and you always do talk about how you miss the pretty scenery. Anyway, we can go out shopping together, okay? It's too early in the morning, and you haven't had breakfast yet. So come on, let's go back in the kitchen. Now, I know you've been hesitant to try my cooking for so long. You've been making all sorts of excuses about it. Well, I am here to change your thoughts. Today, I'll break the curse of my lineage. The Raiden Shogun might be terrible at cooking, but I will prove myself to be better. Now, eat this or die. You're making a face that says, if I eat this, I will die. <sighs> well... It seems I will simply have to coerce you into eating it. Give me your face. Every kiss I give you, Is a bite of my majestic pancake that you will take. Jeez, mm. mm. now my collar is ruffled. You have a way of disrupting my perfection, Mishka. Anyway, now that I've kissed you, you must eat. Still hesitant? <sighs> fine. If you don't eat, it's fine. I only spent three hours making it. Only searched YouTube for thousands of recipes since yesterday. Tried to be the perfect male wife for my little pog champ. <sighs> it's fine. It's totally okay. I'm sorry that I'm not enough for you. It seems I will never be enough, no matter how hard I try. <sighs> Even though all I ever wanted was to be loved by you. 
You'll never return my affections. <laughs> That's my good little mouse. Let me just give you a peck on the forehead, my sweet. That's my good little Mishka. <sighs> well, now, maybe ten tablespoons and ten grams are not quite the same after all. <laughs>